All right, Zach, I got to know. You were a walk-on quarterback here when you first started at William & Mary. Uh, the transition to a wide receiver turned scholarship. What was that like? That was really cool because my whole life I actually played wide receiver. So when I made the transition to quarterback, I was I was actually new at that position. So my junior and senior year, that was kind of more of a learning curve. When I made the transition back, it was kind of just like riding a bike. You know, after about a couple of weeks, I felt like I was back to what I was doing. And I honestly felt that it helped playing quarterback because now I understand, you know, the intricacies of playing wide receiver better, what would help the quarterback. So I feel like our chemistry just benefited from me playing quarterback when I was younger. I also wanted to recognize three men uh, who recently earned full scholarships uh, as members of this attorney. Uh, Trey Watkins, Ryan Ripley, and Zach Burdick. The goal has been scholarship ever since I accepted the walk-on offer. So after years of that hard work, I mean, for that to finally happen, I was just so thankful and so grateful that you know, it really paid off. I remember making the call to my parents and it was something that I'll never forget. So I'll, I will never forget, you know, getting that scholarship. It means the world to me. All right, Zach, I gotta know, what is your biggest play in the 2019 season? I Lay don't it on me. too hard about that one. Lay it on me. <laughs> Richmond in overtime, the game winning touchdown. That felt sweet because, you know, Richmond's our big rival to walk into their place and take that Capital Cup back, that post-game locker room feeling, that was that was definitely the best. I got to know. Now, there's a rumor that you can cook. If that rumor's true, what is your favorite dish to make? So right now, especially when I'm really, really hungry, I will make this, um, it's, a, it's a cheeseburger, but it's got like a fried egg on it. I'll make it for you sometime. All right, coach. So I did some digging and I found out that you were in the Navy for four years. So I got to know, how hard is boot camp for real? Well, if you don't know how to swim, boot camp's definitely going to be hard. But uh, boot camp was about just perseverance, finding yourself, um, and how to get through something with the team. Everyone knows you're a man of energy. I got to know, what's your favorite part about being a football coach? My favorite part about being a football coach is practice. Yes, practice. <laughs> you're with your team. You're coaching your guys up. I mean, you practice more than you actually play. And so I think you get better as a group. You find yourself um, as a team and a unit to prepare yourself for the game. So, yes, practice. Practice. Not the game, Not but the practice. Game. <laughs> practice. All right, coach. So I'm taking a page out of Hot Ones from YouTube about an Instagram deep dive. So I got to know what is going on here. Can you explain to me? Oh, 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 oh. Can you explain oh. to the viewers what's going on here? That was some deep diving, but if you really have to know, I was exfoliating my face with my daughter. So it's all about smooth skin. Man, you, you went deep, you went deep there. So with William Mary's motto being Faith Family Football, I gotta know, how special is it to work alongside your dad, Coach London? Oh man, uh, that, that one goes deep there. Um, it's, it's an extreme blessing to start my college career under my father. Um, I've, I've watched my father since I was two years old um, become a leader of great men, uh, just, just win championships, work hard in this profession. So when you grow up, ideally, that's who you want to become is you want to become your father. Um, and it's been a blessing just to be under his coaching staff. Um, it's a part of my coaching career that I will always look back and cherish um, probably the most, probably the most.